Super Seducer, we going into the club, so we dressing right today, I know y'all see it, I know y'all see it, we about to get all the girls in the club right now, yeah, <sighs> yeah, see y'all already know I can do this, y'all already know that I can put this thing down, but I'm only going to do a few bars today, only a few, wash my shoes Yo, super seducer, what? I don't want to lose her, but if she want to leave me, she can be somebody's freebie. I don't need that negative energy in my life. We staying good, striving for to be the greatest. He's the greatest on the top, the highest top. Hey, she playing with my top. Oh, I know. Oh, y'all know. <laughs> All right, let's get into this thing. Let me stop messing around. And before I read this, don't think I forgot about my peoples. Look, 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 look. They here too. They was, uh, you know, they was chilling, taking a nap. But no, y'all gotta wake up today. Y'all gotta wake up today. We got a big task. We're not taking. And what we're not gonna do is take an L. But he's still gonna be here anyway. All right. She's the prettiest girl in the club. But she's on the dance floor, and the music is loud. You don't have dance moves, but you do have the seduction skills to win her. That was a question. Yeah, I have the seduction skills. You about to find out right now. And yes, I have been to a club before, so don't even ask. Dr. Cap. Hey. Pole in the club, yeah. Looking for her. Looking at that body. That body yaddy. Body yaddy. Hey, hey, getting down, girl. What you want, girl? Ooh, I was starting to get in that. I was starting to get in that. Listen, don't play on my top like that. I can rap. Alright, so here's our choices. Because y'all already know how this thing go. Open with an opinion opener about which present to get your baby sister. Hip bump her. Non-verbally open by catching her attention. Or twerk attack. Okay. <laughs> We're going to be picking some wrong answers today. I'm just in that mood. We're going to see what happens when you do the twerk attack. Oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yo, I thought she would like that actually. I'm not going to lie. I thought she would actually One of my friend laugh. Alex's moves. Um, he does it when he's very, very drunk. Yeah. And doesn't work too well. Only the girls twerk. Yeah, so that's not a good... I thought she would laugh at least a little bit. She was not amused by that. Alright, now I think hip bumper... No, we non-verbally catch our attention. We're in a club. Look, she's over there dancing. Look, she's smiling at us. Look, she with it. We don't have the dance moves, but we can try. Look, she's smiling at us. In a us. noisy environment, you don't want to be too conversational. Don't, so don't play up my time like that. by catching her attention non-verbally is the right choice. I know it is, because I picked it. Look, my man's trying. He don't have the dance moves, he said, but he trying to do his best. That's all you can do. I would do something like that too. Hey. Alright. Quickly introduce yourself and continue dancing. Start a dance off. Ask if she wants a drink. Ask to whom she is there with. Obviously, there, there, there's, this is the only right answer because, again, we're at a club, so you're not going to do all that talking. Hey. I'm Richard. Hey. Jenna. Nice to meet you. <laughs> 
that's all you have to say. Then you get right down to dancing. Yeah. That's it. You don't want to be, spend too long talking because it's a noisy dance floor. So that's exactly it. Better be very taking notes too. Then back to dance. Take notes. All right. Dance closer to her. Ask what she likes to do in her spare time. Or moonwalk away. You know, the moonwalk away would be kind of smooth, but we're trying to get closer to her. We're not trying to go away. Because if we moonwalk away, she'll just leave. I, I want to pick that so bad to see if he can actually move off. You know what? We're going to pick that. Listen, I told you, we're picking some wrong, we pick some wrong choices today. Let's see how he does this. Can he actually do it? I mean, I can't see his feet. Look, she's like, whatever. I told you that wouldn't work. Moonwalk? Really? <laughs> Listen, if Michael Jackson can do it, if he can do that and get bitches, then so can we. But it doesn't work in this scenario, so... We're gonna obviously get closer to her. We need the distance to be smaller. Hey. Hey. Oh, look, see? So she's down for it. Hey. I didn't think it would be that easy, but okay. If you're just dancing kind of near her, then, you know, she could move away. So you want mm -hmm. to escalate a little bit, get a little bit closer. All right. Now is the time where we start to escalate things just a tiny bit because, yeah, we've been dancing for a little bit, so we're not going to be doing this the whole time. Now, what we're not going to do is try to kiss her. That's too early, way too early. I know we had a club, but no, that's way too early. Ask her if she wants to sit down because she must be tired from dancing in heels. Well, we don't even know she's wearing heels. Technically, we don't even know. No, we're going to go to get a drink. I'm thirsty. Let's go get a drink. Yeah, sure. Yeah. See, that's how you do. You take control. That's what the man Perfect. does. Because you're always waiting for the time on the dance floor to get off of there. Because, you you know, there's only so much you can do in that noisy, busy place. And the right time to do it is when the music changes and it's a lame track. I mean, it was the same track, though. Oh, now it's not. But this ain't, this ain't lame, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. It ain't lame. So you really like dancing, eh? I do. Obviously. Yeah, very much. But you seem sober. It's strange. Why are you in the club and you still seem sober? <laughs> I can't dance as well if I drink too much. All right, that's a lie. I'm tired now. I don't play with you. Yeah, that's okay. okay. No, I'm not standing. And I think, I saw you, obviously I saw you on the dance floor, but I think before, did I see you in the smoking area? Was that you? Smoking? Yeah, probably. Oh. You don't like smoking? Ugh. Ugh. No, I don't. I ain't gonna lie to you. I hate smoking. That shit is disgusting. What do you get out of that? I don't see what you get out of that. You think that's cute? That's not cute. <sighs> should I spare her feelings or should I really say what I mean? Okay, say you're into harder drugs. Yeah, I'm into that cocaine. <laughs> Tell her it's no problem even if you don't smoke. Oh, it's a problem. She needs to know. Tell her you don't like smoking, but it's her choice. She needs to know. Well, I don't smoke, but, you know, it's your choice. But I do hope one day you will quit. Exactly. <laughs> I'm, I'm working on it. Yeah? Everybody yeah. says that. Yeah. Right. It doesn't actually that. work out. I'll encourage you by reminding you constantly that it's... No, not really. I'll just encourage you. <laughs> she not probably gets that enough, but it still doesn't that work. That would be helpful. Yeah, that probably still doesn't work. On one hand, you don't want to nag her. And on the other hand, you don't want to tell her it's great. She exactly. think it is. So this is the correct be honest middle ground here, and see? it's the right choice. Well done. I know how things go around here. And so you smoke, but do you have any other bad habits? Or is that it? I think it's the only real bad one. I can be messy sometimes. If that's messy in what way? I don't my nails or anything. I'm trying to find Compulsive out. Gambler or don't use no, that. Not yet. Like, what, is <laughs> what is it? Like, what's, what's the word for the people that have to steal things? Like there's a um, technical... Oh, oh, I don't remember. You're talking you about know there is one uh, though, right? Um, about to steal her heart. Like a, but that's people that have sex with dead people. Check it, necrophilia, actually. No, uh, not and I was thinking narcolepsy, that. but that's the sleeping one. But narcolepsy. there's definitely one for stealing stuff. There is. Um, you still haven't. Do you have any bad habits? Girl, I ain't got no bad habits. Look at me. Does it look like I have that in me? Okay. Say you like to inflict pain on people. Yeah, that's a very bad habit. I just like to punch everybody I see. Say you have none. She won't believe that shit. Even if you really don't have any, she won't believe that. 
So we got to go with the honest response. What is he going to say? I don't think I have anything too bad, but it depends what you think. So I don't know, like sometimes I might smoke weed. Oh, um, smoking. So you think tried, smoking weed like, is super good, hard drug, but smoking but cigarettes couple, is bad? Couple drugs. They're both and bad. So I, think that, I don't know, don't sometimes do I can be really harsh with people. Don't smoke. A little bit That's impatient. Good impatient. Okay. okay. No, I'm sure I have some bad ones, but nothing, nothing super bad. And definitely nothing, nothing like right a, you know, a habit that, that really annoys people. Okay. <laughs> That's good. I mean, she Excellent. liked that. In this case, yeah, you want to have some honesty and I mean, you know, sometimes honesty feel, can be I mean, shocking, surprising, it. but it has an interesting effect on her attraction levels. They're likely to go up. You see, so tell me, do you have any all this, good habits all these to like help you stuff don't work in the real world? Yeah, um, I don't. dance a lot. I, yeah. I like to go hiking. Really um, I take my dog and we hike in the mountains a lot. Oh yeah, um, she got a dog. It's great. And let me see. Yoga? Do you have a dream of like climbing Everest or Kilimanjaro or something no, like it's this? Too Kilimanjaro. <laughs> too cold. I like to be warm. But I have some friends that climb Kilimanjaro and yeah. they're just regular people. Like they started in no. the morning yeah, well, they and they got to the it. top by sunset or they had help. nightfall. Yeah, of course. They're of course they had help. Thing, but they can't do that. It seems like right? it's kind of easy. I wouldn't no. do it either, girl. I'm you wouldn't do it. Uh, I like to think I would. So, <laughs> but if you put me there, I don't know. <laughs> So you hike, what else do you do? Um, lots of sports. I like, I tried climbing recently. Sometimes I play squash, used to play tennis. But I guess now I just go to the gym a few times a week and that's about it. You go to the gym? Yeah. Really? Ooh. Ooh. Did y'all hear that slick shit she just said out her mouth? He said, he goes to the gym two or three times a week and she act like she don't believe shit he just said. She said, really? Like, it doesn't look like it. Girl. I mean, I probably can't see that. Oh, I go to the gym. Oh, I go to the gym. Don't patronize me before you get slapped. Tell her she doesn't look like she goes to the gym either. You know, I could fire back at her. But you know, that might not work. If I really was heated, I could say that. Say you get too much. No, this is the right one. Like, this is the right one. Cause, come Look, on. I'm going to be straight with you. Yeah. It's quite a problem for me at the moment with girls because uh, I just get, get too, too much, much attention. And when I'm I get too many know, just of slightly why. close to a girl, she wants to get married and all of this mm -hmm. stuff. And I don't have a six pack, so imagine if I add a six pack as well. So I go to the gym, but I'm always there, and I'm like, "Shall I do two more?" Well, yeah. I get to, you know, so the you girls don't... like me a lot already, so look so at her. Do it for the benefit of women. Well, so look at her face. Much. Do it for benefit of women. I mean, they're already benefited she, she... a lot, so <laughs> it's look mainly for me. But it's just that extra know. motivation that you get when you're single and desperate, <laughs> and you're like, "I need a girl. Come on, one I more rep. And come you on." Have so many. Yep, so many. No, she thinks we're when joking. When I'm single, I do. But when but I have a relationship, you don't realize I only have I've one. already got like three other girls okay. before you. So yeah, we do. Notice that this is said with a smirk, but it is taking her attack and not being a wussy and put it you know, right about to it, center, not crying about it, center. not attacking her back, being playful and playing this kind of arrogant, cocky role. It actually yeah. works really well when it's done tongue in cheek. Just think Robert Downey Jr. I'm Robert trying to guess. Downey I mean, Jr. when I look that? at you, I think you're kind of, I don't know, something to do with music. I don't know why I think that, but what did she study at university? Um, I actually she studied did. dance. She didn't look like she did music. Dance? I you, did. Stu you studied? I did. Dance. You could study dance? I didn't know they had that. <laughs> well, don't I, I know, know they have like dance. ballet schools and stuff, but you it's, can study. Uh, there's music at the university too. It's an uh, art school. Um, but oh. yes, dance, uh, ballet, um, ballet jazz, okay. hip hop. Yeah, yeah. hip hop. <laughs> A lot Timberlake. of things. Like Usher. Just yeah, exactly, exactly hip -hop. like that. Like we were here. This guy. And, um, so that was university, but what's your job now? Are you something, I a actually dancer own or a something? dance studio. Ooh, she owns a dance studio. <sighs> Obviously, she teaches strippers. Wow. Don't even go there. I <sighs> I said I was going to pick some wrong answers, and I did. But I don't know if I should say the stripper part, because uh, we, already, we already took that attack she did and returned to send her, so I, I don't think we should go back and do that. Like ask more questions get more information 
No, anytime you get to compliment her, you're gonna do it. We're gonna compliment her. You know what? I really like that because it's something entrepreneurial and it's something you're where you're her, really see? doing something you're passionate about. Yeah, right? you got yeah. the chance, so, you do it. No, big respect for that. Plus, you know, it's a big, big risk. Respect. And not to be, I don't think it's sexist. I think it's the fact that women don't normally take those risks, like to uh, to open their own business and stuff. I mean, so they do very, very cool. Thank so, you. Yeah, it's been it's been wonderful. I love doing it. And tell me, what, who do you teach? Children. Yeah, children. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I love kids. Like um, ballet for little girls. Ballet for little girls, like five. Oh, that shit. It's so cute, yeah. actually. Yeah, yeah, when yeah. They... Five to ten. And they actually <laughs> love it as well. Yeah, we have um, we have a dance at the end of every class, uh, every mm. school period, like every six months. We have a dance recital. Very cool. Thank you have some videos you. on YouTube of it. I do. You have to show me later. Okay. Does she really? <laughs> You're joking, right? This is, is that, undoubtedly is a, real? a cool Does thing about her, so you definitely need to connect up. on it and compliment her. I'm about to look that she's up. Have I'm not going to lie to you. A lot of emotions in there, and you want to be positive. I just noticed you got some tattoos. Oh, my Ooh, she just... Yeah. Oh, okay, see? We getting... We get, we escalating it even more with the with the physical touch, you know? We get a little bit more sensual. And that's how I like it. We like that. We like that. We tend to read it and it says that she likes to have multiple <laughs> sex with multiple men at once. Say that you don't really like them. Well, okay. For me, I don't like tattoos. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I don't like tattoos, but I can't tell her that if I'm trying to get her. I can't. This is interesting. You've got like coordinates here. <laughs> yeah. what, what's that? Is some something special there. It is. Uh, I went to Iceland it and yeah. those are coordinates from my favorite waterfall from the trip. Oh, like and the most the beautiful experience. place or something. Yes, and the mountain range is Asia. It was uh, the first mountain range we drove through when we went. Mm -hmm. So very special. So the idea is that you had an amazing time and you just look at it and you... Yeah, it was the adventure of my life. So I wanted it forever. Nice, I get it. <laughs> I was like, what's that? That makes perfect sense. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's strange. Cool. She's laughing. When she laughs, that's usually a good if sign. If someone has an interesting tattoo, there's usually a story behind it. They're going to be uh, used to telling the story, but then by handling it in the right way, you'll still make them feel good and have a good moment of connection. So I think that's probably enough about me. <laughs> what is it that you do? Uh, it's kind of kind of strange, really right? Really so I'm not, I'm not like really an accountant or whatever. So um, it's, I make videos for YouTube, so okay. I could sound um, like a YouTube professional. <laughs> what sort of videos would you mean? Different videos like in different subjects giving advice about health and different okay. things and then he uh, kind of makes money by like, the advertising and it, you know when there's that, those annoying real? ads in YouTube? Yes. So basically <laughs> that's, that's how you make the money. That's what's paying yeah. me, like one cent each one or whatever okay. and it adds up. Interesting. So. Well I did notice that you're very well groomed. Oh thank um, you. I was hoping it didn't mean that you were into men. What? Whoa. Wait, wait, wait. You're not gonna speed past that like I didn't just hear what you said. Oh my god. Just because you're well groomed does not make you gay. Whoa, whoa. So you you telling me that you see anybody that looks good, well groomed, that you do think they're gay? Nah, you gotta go. That's out of pocket. That's out of pocket, you gotta go. No, I'm not. I've had lots of girlfriends. Even though that's probably true for him. So you're homophobic? That's cool, no, I'm straight. React angrily to show her it's not cool and you're offended. Nah, see, this is one of them other times. She she's trying to she's trying to test us. She's testing us, and we're not gonna fall for it. Cause I know. Wait, hold on. Wh which is the one? Yeah, yeah. You know what? We gonna act like that. It's funny you should say that because I do have you know. Because as you touch her, of, you can just yeah. see like I'm. <laughs> I'm touching you, but it doesn't mean gay. anything because I'm gay, right? Mm. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah? yeah? So it's cool. It's cool. <laughs> you see that? Very gay. You feel it, right? <laughs> That's why there's no chemistry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. How you like that? When a girl challenges you, like you, that you don't want to get angry, you don't want to get defensive, yeah, right? So this is the perfect response. Well done for choosing. I, I... Oh, um, you know when you date guys or meet guys, I assume you do sometimes, yeah? But <laughs> sometimes. is it usually in clubs? Because for me, it's definitely mm. not. Um, I mean, no, I, I try not to. Um, it's not the best, right? No, it doesn't always seem like the most honest environment to meet someone. Yeah. Well, most people go into yeah, clubs are just right. looking for something that's not serious, right? That's the right. general thing. <laughs> yeah, or to have fun with their friends. 
Yeah. Only? Mostly yeah. Yeah. Phone I try not to. Who goes to a but you know what? The good thing we've met, right? Not mm -hmm. long ago, but we're not too drunk. <laughs> we've managed to find this quiet place for conversation. This so like this maybe uh, we shouldn't categorize it as the usual awful club thing, right? Yep, that's it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you want to escalate things. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now let me read this carefully because let me, let me try to do this right. Brush her hair back and tell her she has cute little ears. Tell her that she's really turning you on and you want to kiss her. Look at her mouth as she is talking. Or grab her ass. Grab an ass. That's the last thing we want to do. Like, that's the final step. Look at her mouth as she is talking. I have heard that that actually works. And I think it does. I'm, I might try that. I might try that. I've heard that actually works. So I guess it's not too personal, right? But where did you meet your last... Uh, boyfriend. Uh, I gotta see the way the he university. does it though. <laughs> we were partners, so mm -hmm. by default, I guess we got very close. Um, mm -hmm. Look at him. <laughs> he looks so. Yeah. The way he looks, he looks um, like he's crazy. So we were partners, so it was just kind of natural, I guess. But she looks like she's digging it. Look at her. She's smiling. She's digging it. She's digging it. She's loving it. She's definitely loving it. This is a great one to try. Um, you know, you did it in the game, you can try it in real life as well. It works because you're bringing in that sexual element but in a very smooth way, you know, it's smooth. not aggressive all at all. About it's smooth. kind of playful, but it works. That's the name of the game. So I actually didn't ask, but what did you study in school? Well, to be honest, I didn't go to university, but it's just because um, I didn't really like school when I was young. I was intelligent, but I was kind of bullied and the kids called on. me ugly and stuff. Really? Yeah, I have no pictures from that time. I hated how I looked and everyone called me ugly, so it was, it was just They unhappy. still call me but ugly. It's okay, I'm right now. But You're very watching. handsome now. But, ooh, she called him handsome, see? Didn't expect that one. But what that, what that Mike Jones song say back then? <laughs> Yo, I'm not even gonna say it. Yo, thank you. You have beautiful eyes. She hears that all the time. Oh, no, I'm not. You really are beautiful though, the best girl I have seen. Even though that's true, you ain't gonna say that. You haven't seen the best part of me yet. What do you mean by that though? What do you mean by that? Tell me something I don't know. No, just accept the compliment. Just accept oh, it. Oh, that's nice of you to say. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome, I mean it. See? All you gotta do is accept it. It's gonna be very hard to resist the response. Oh, thank you, you yeah. too, or something like that. And actually it's much better not to because you've got into a great position where mm -hmm. she's the one saying nice things about you and you want to keep her in that position where she's oh. the one working harder you than you are. You can keep her in the one type of position yeah, if you know what I mean. Cheers, by the way. <laughs> Cheers. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. Y'all yeah. mm. only taking little sips of, of y'all drink. Y'all have a I know lot we haven't been talking for long, but to me it's, um, it's going pretty well so far. So I'm yeah. happy yeah. I came and talked to you. Me too. <laughs> this is going very well. <sighs> like this. I like this. She looks good. We, nope, we probably would never have a chance if we were actually saw her in real life. She's too good, too good looking. So just you leave right there and then go to your place. Nah, shut things back down and talk about new Dane stuff again. That's what she ever made. <laughs> <laughs> Ask her if she's seen anyone. That would be a good question, cause I mean we doing all this, but uh, well, I mean I guess if we're having conversations like this, you would hope that she's not. I mean you're in a club. Who takes their significant other to a club? That's asking for somebody to just grab right all under there, grab all under there. We gonna chill it down. We gonna chill it down because you're not hungry we don't get too time. high. <laughs> I mean, I could be. Yeah. What well, what food do you like? Mm, I uh -huh. usually like pretty healthy See? foods, um, but You're I also really like likes, hamburgers. Yeah. Huh? What? <laughs> How does that work? I don't so know. you're usually healthy, and then just like once in yeah. a while, just it's like the guilty know, pleasure of food, you know? Guilty okay. pleasure. I'm thinking yeah. of the guilty pleasure. I get that. I'm quite healthy as well. <laughs> Are you? All the time. Do you like burgers? No, I think my guilty food would be. Uh, pizza, pasta, ice cream, pizza, chocolate, pasta, <laughs> not all better. at once, but you're healthy. something like that, but yeah, 99% healthy. <laughs> okay. I mean, I guess that's 99%. Surprisingly, guess. that's the correct choice because a lot of guys 
go to clubs, meet girls, get off with them, and then the girls see it as a bit of fun and they don't yep. respond to the messages. Exactly. So if you actually want to see a girl again, you do want to slow things down, place, chill for a bit, and get that real connection that can go along real with connection. the sexual stuff that you can always bring back at any time. It's shows a lot of confidence and control as well. You can always bring that sexual stuff back, you know what I'm saying? So that's that you leave to go and eat somewhere, somewhere will be your place. Say you know somewhere with better music and great wine, aka your house, so just going to the after party at your house. <laughs> your friends are coming and she can invite her friends. Okay, we were just talking about eating stuff so we'll just continue with that you know what i'm actually really hungry so what do you say we get out of here and go eat something <laughs> okay yeah, yeah i cook a mean pasta actually and i've got some nice wine so <laughs> let's get out of here <laughs> the goal was to take her home and look holding her hand and all that instead of saying let's go back to my place which usually gets a no yeah. um you want to make it a little bit more you know, undercurrent, but not specific. So that's the way to do it. I mean, nowadays people are more specific and we got that super, super, super In a noisy environment, rating. you don't want to be too conversational. Because that's how we so are. We always are super seducer. <laughs> yeah, I had accidentally hit the wrong freaking, I didn't want the next level. Y'all didn't see that. Y'all didn't see that. But yeah, the next one is the girl sitting in the coffee shop. Typically, I don't, well, a club, I can kind of see where you can do this, but coffee shop, I don't think that's an appropriate place. Well, not that it's not appropriate, but it just seems weird to do it at a coffee shop. But that's just me. But chapter three is done. Another girl we've taken with us. And I don't mean in that way. We've taken her with under bar, you know. Just leave it right there. But as you see, we're definitely not done. We got this one, then we've got oh my gosh, we we have like five more to do. Wait. First day Alexa. Wait, that looks familiar. Is that the girl from the first one? That is. Oh shoot. Oh, I can't wait to get to that because we already have chemistry with her, so we can't fuck that up. But <sighs> that's it for now, my friends. Stay popping out there. And we'll see you next time.